When England take to the Stade de France for their opening Six Nations fixture next weekend, all eyes will be on the players. How will the Saracens stars fare away from their turbulent club? Will the uncapped players hit the ground running? Has Eddie Jones made enough changes from the squad that lost the World Cup final? While all those questions are valid, the most significant changes have been behind the scenes. Read more. Six Nations 2020 squads, Rhys Zammett a hugely exciting prospect for Wales, Sexton uncertainty a problem for Ireland Jones's coaching staff has undergone a huge overhaul during the winter, with only defence coach John Mitchell remaining in the same post. If you can't beat them, hire their forwards coach Matt Proudfoot has joined as forwards coach following a successful stint with Rugby World Cup winners South Africa where he coached the pack that so brutally got the better of England in November's final. While not always the most aesthetic of performances, it was Proudfoot who presided over the scrum which caused England and Jones so many problems as they went on to win the final by a record 20-point margin. It highlighted the importance at the highest level of the game of the forwards in securing the ball and building from the front. So who better than the man who identified England's weaknesses to now fix them? Proudfoot was born and raised in South Africa but spent much of his playing career in Scotland, representing the country four times after qualifying through his granddad, who was from Dumfries. He spent three and a half years with the Springboks, working under both Alistair Coetzee and Rassi Erasmus, having helped Erasmus develop tight heads Franz Malherbe and Vincent Koch, loose head Stephen Kitchoff and Hukum Bongai during their previous spell at Stormers. It will be hoped he can have a similarly positive impact on Kyle Sinclair. Ellis Genge and others in the front row. The 47 year old takes over from Steve Borthwick, who is staying with England but switching to skills coach until the summer, when he will join Leicester Tigers in his first head coach role. It will signal the end of an eight year partnership with Jones, having followed the Australian to England from Japan. Melbourne Storm assistant coach Jason Riles, who has a background in rugby league and has assisted with the England setup intermittently during Jones's tenure. Will come in as Borthwick's replacement in November. Under the new look approach, Proudfoot will also be responsible for the scrum, following the departure of Neil Hadley to Bath after the World Cup. A new approach. While both of those departures had been expected, England suffered another blow late last year when it emerged that attack coach Scott Wisemantle was to leave with immediate effect and return to his native Australia to join the national side under Dave Rennie. Jones has called on England for more on this story. Visit the news article link.